Welcome back everyone. Let's take a look at how can we use a cross-sectional view in FEMAP. Okay, well if you think that you need to look for something called cross-sectional view, that is probably because you are used to another software like SOLIDWORKS and over there we call it cross-sectional view, but in FEMAP we actually call it, go to this button right here, view style, go down, and it's called clipping plane. Okay, this is the one we are working with. This will give you a cross-sectional view. Same thing like in SOLIDWORKS. It'll slice it in half and you can view inside. Okay, so let's set one up. Click on plane. Let's see. Define clipping plane. So I'm going to go ahead and use one of the global axes. Right here, global plane. And let's see ZY. ZY, ZY, there you go. ZY axis. Z zero zero zero. What the ZY? Okay. Click OK. And if we go back to the same button, clipping plane on. Bam. There you go. And cut my vehicle in half. Nice. Well, what happened if? Uh, oh, I wanted the other side, not this one. Well, then go back to the button, clipping plane, and clip positive side. There you go. It'll give you the other side. Okay. Here you go. Okay, and if you don't want to see this anymore, go on. You want to go back to the original clipping plane, clipping on. And then it turns it off. <laughs> okay, there you go. Now you know where to find it. Alright, that would be it. Make sure you guys tune in for the next video so you can get your skills even better. Like and subscribe and have a good day.